Hello, entrepreneurs. Joe DeCara, CPA, coming to you live from downtown Flushing, New York, for another amazing episode of How to Win at Business. And if you're watching live, give me a hashtag live, please. If you're watching the replay, give me a hashtag replay. And if you're not watching, you don't have to leave any any hashtag. And if you if you're interested in, in chatting with me, all you got to do is go to Time with Joe, any of the topics that I talk about here, taxes, business, finding money, getting government grants, that, that's what we do. Uh, my team and I uh, have put together a really uh, great foundation for small business owners, and, and that's what I want to talk about today, which is how to find great help. It's not easy. You know, it's not easy starting and running a business even if you if you're the only one you know it's hard enough uh, to do things if you're a tiny business okay and, and you could keep things under control but if you're any good and you start getting busy you're going to need help and, and that's how it's been it's it's always been like that for me i i i worked with uh my mom for a long time, she did a lot of work I wasn't even aware of, and it was shocking uh, when she decided to retire, and, and I learned about how hard her job was. And I had to find people to replace her, and it wasn't just one person. I, I had to find several people. Uh, and also, I wanted to start scaling my business. Uh, Yes. So whoever messaged me, yeah, just uh, go to uh, timewithjoe.com. I appreciate it. I can't see who's who's messaging me. If you have any questions on these topics, uh, you can post them in in the chat, and I will definitely get back to you. I go I go back and, and check to see if, if people are asking questions. So definitely do that. So how do you find good help? Okay, you gotta you gotta have a process. So for me, what I did was I used my my coach's business. He has a business called HireMyVA.com, and what they did was they they taught us actually how to go through the hiring process. And it's really not simple, you know. You gotta what we had to do was basically make people jump through hoops. But before you even do that, before you want to find a qualified person, you got to define what the job actually is. You see, when, when my mom was, was doing stuff, she didn't tell me all the details. We didn't have uh, a, an employee manual. She just, she just did it. She got the job done. And, and because the job was getting done, I didn't ask any questions. And I got comfortable, and and I, I wound up hiring a couple of bad, not bad people. They were good people, but they just weren't qualified for the job. And, and what I realized was, I didn't clearly define what the job was. I just said, okay, your job is to get the information from the clients. However, you're going to do it. Well, if they never did that before. You have to define the steps. You have to say, okay, this is how we're doing it. And sometimes you got to do it yourself. You got to do it yourself and, and come up with the sequences. So, one thing my coach has, has this uh, worksheet to uh, write down every task that you do in your job. So, every time you have a task, you list it and you'd be surprised when you look at that if you do it for three or four days and and you won't you'll be surprised at how many little details go into everything that we do and we just we do it without thinking of it because we've done it so many times so when i i hire somebody to do a tax return i was telling them hey Look at last year's return, go into the program, open it up, look at all the lines and compare it with the documents that we get for this year. Well, people were making mistakes because I told I told them what to do. I didn't show them. So what we started to do was we started 
for every every task, every sequence, every step, we made a little Loom video. So if if a client needed to go on extension, I would do a video showing them, okay, this is how you do an extension form for a client. So now I could tell them and I could show them and I could do it with them. You know, this is uh, 2021, folks. It's, it's so easy to just do a Zoom call, show somebody what they need to do in their job, and record it. And then you have it forever. So that's one part of it. You, you get great people. Number one, you got to find the people, but you got to give them the tools and the resources and the instructions on how to succeed in their job. Another thing that, that, we, that we learned is that people want to do a good job. They want to they wanna be rewarded and, and commended for doing what you hired them for. And it's, it's not always, you know, money. They, they want, hey, thank you. You did a great job. You know, you really stepped up here. And, and that empowers them. So what's happened over the last three months, we, our team really has just come together at a level that I, I, I'm really amazed and I'm, I'm proud of them. And I wanted to share this with people because it is important. There's, you know, I'm Joe DeChara. I'm the CEO of Bedrock Business Builders, but there is no Bedrock Business Builders without my team. And, and if, if any of you are watching, I, do, I want to thank you, and I do appreciate you, and we're going to keep doing what we're doing because it's working. And, and again, if you want to connect with me, just go to Time with Joe. And one other surprise, uh, Mastermind with Joe DeChara. We, we have great mastermind meetings every Saturday and Tuesday. We play Japardi. We have fun. We connect with people. And last but not least, folks, I have an event coming up on June 15th that I want to invite everyone to. Uh, I put the link in the chat box. So that, that's how you can sign up. It's going to be all about improving your cash flow, getting grants, getting lines of credit so that you can run your business, uh, finding money anywhere that we can. That, that's my new model. Let us find you the money. We will find you the money. Just connect with me. Go to Time with Joe. Uh, God bless. I hope you enjoyed this uh, little get together and I will see you again shortly. Thank you.